Don't let him talk about your mind like that. Yeah, you got this, odd rabbit. I'm from. Knock some decency back in his bloodline. He's not worth the time, Alf. You got a problem? Of course. His mother worships Venus for a living. The real question is, why are you defending him? Because he doesn't choose who his mother is or what she does. If we're being honest here, she and her affiliates are better off being rabbits. But if it's a fight you want, <laughs> then let them fight. We tell Joshua to go easy on the youngins. You can complain, or you can help me take them into custody. Barnaby, how did you end up here? Ma, they were being jerks. Disrespecting him because of his family. Think about the honor of your family. Do you want to drag that for someone else? The right thing to do was to do something. Right, Dad? Use your head, Lewis. You need to pick and choose who to fight for. Especially not for someone else's future as aimless as that Mars-eyed rabbit. Provoking fruitless violence is beneath this family. I should have known that rabbit would have been involved. You better stay far away from him from now on. You hear me, Steven? Roy, whatever that rabbit's mother does on this island is too complicated to understand for a child of 13 years. Focus on your craft so you won't end up as that odd Mars-eyed rabbit. So, this is what you do instead of helping out at the shop. If you're going to get into a fight with a societal threat like him, you better win. You can join my friend group, you know, if you want. I'll pass. Oh! Well, Sarah said that at first, but it took a little time and no more friends. Past the friends at that. Two, I don't think you can go that one, but I must tell you're just a stranger, right? Also, I really, really like your eyes. You're close to my like, oh, Southern friend you got over there. Also, you should grow out your hair. You look like a boy. Worry about your dress, and I'll worry about my hair. Take care. Overseer Michelangelo would like to have a word with you. An overseer? Yeah! Let's talk. So, what's this all about? You tell me. Boy, please don't play games with me. No! You don't get to call me boy! I've seen Moss more useful than you and your nept overseer crew. Subdue. Let's try this again. They were wishing harm on my mother. They said things. Horrible things, I'm afraid. If true. Good boy. What's your mother's profession? They say daughter of Venus. That profession? is allowed all over the island. There must be more than that. They say, daughter of Venus. Mama told me they don't want her, but their money is louder. I don't understand. That's all I need, good boy. You can keep the treat. Don't forget to bless the cycle for the meal. B bless the cycle. Overseer Michelangelo, I'm sorry for what I said. Can you plead to the spirits the safety of my mother? Don't worry, I'll let the spirits know of this suffering. Okay. While I'll be occupied with prayer, this officer will look after you for a while and escort you home. Before that, we'll talk outside. He's got a lot of energy. You don't suppress that. You channel it. Oh, well, it's just that I haven't taken care of a child before. It takes a village. You're in good hands. While you're at it, get in good standing with his mom. 
marry her if you need to. All I'm advising is for you doing your part to make this a more perfect society. Uh, as you wish, Overseer Michelangelo. Call me if things get out of hand. About what you did to the boy. He'll be fine. Alright, Fiona. Let's go home. Are we gonna do something about the rabbit girl? That's tomorrow's problem. When I heard it was Field Chimera's child getting into trouble, it sounded like a problem that's been brewing for long enough. Fair enough. I'm just afraid she might have access to Topside. I'll find a handler to make sure she's in line. Beautiful night tonight, ain't it, Fiona? Right, Overseer Michelangelo.